Hello and welcome to RegoFix Tech Chat. My name is David McHenry. I am the engineering and technical manager here at RegoFix USA. Today, let's talk ER tool holders. We've had lots of people request, hey, what makes a RegoFix tool holder different? So, let's grab a few holders and let's go over what makes a standard RegoFix ER collet chuck that much different than everybody else's. ER tool holders are an industry norm nowadays. You can find them in every single shop, but every tool holder's not the same. So let's go over some of the basic features of a RegoFix ER tool holder. And we're gonna start back here in the taper first. All standard RegoFix ER collet chucks in steep taper have an AT3 taper specification. That tells us just how much tolerance we can have over the length of that taper. For added confidence, RegoFix doesn't just measure the top of the taper and the bottom of the taper. We actually measure the top, the middle, and the bottom. That allows us to control the profile shape of that taper so that it fits in your spindle with more spindle contact. Three-point measuring, much more accurate than the most common we see from cheaper manufacturers where they measure two spots in the middle. Well, not quite sure what you're going to get with that one. So standard AT3 tapers for standard tool holders. We also have a tolerance for the taper on the outside to the inside of the ER collet cavity of three microns or better. That allows you to have the repeatability and the assurance that when you put this into your spindle, you are receiving the best runout possible on your machine spindle. All of our tool holders are hardened to a 60 Rockwell hardness. And that is a surface hardness. It is not a through hardness. That gives you a nice, durable internal hardness of around 45 and an external hardness of 60 for long wear and wear resistance. You also have the ability with standard ER collet chucks to balance them at any time. 90% of our ER offering has the ability to snap balancing rings on at any point in time during the lifespan of that tool holder and balance it for higher speed applications. Now, just because we can accept balancing rings doesn't mean the tool holder isn't balanced from the factory. It is. Our base tool holder balance is G2.5 at 25,000, and we go up to 90,000 RPMs for the smaller HSK series. So balanced by design, balanced from the factory, and the ability to add balancing rings in the future. As with any ER tool holder, you also have the end or the working end where the threads are. We use a much tighter tolerance on our threads why do we do that? Well, when I take my nut and I put the nut on top of the tool holder, I want that nut to go straight down on the threads. I don't want it to be pulled off to the side or move around too much in the process. By having a tighter tolerance, we keep the threads on the tool holder in plane with the tool holder center line. That gives you more accuracy and gives you the best repeatability possible from tool clamp to tool clamp. Now, all of our ER collet chucks are gonna come provided with a standard high Q nut, which we've already talked about in other videos for higher performance and higher clamping force. There are a lot more details we can go into when we talk about our ER collet chucks, but I'd request that you contact your local RegoFix representative if you have any questions. Again, my name is David McHenry. Thank you very much.